Hey guys, Lone Hawk here, welcome back to the channel. Uh, today we are starting a brand new series, Mafia 2 The Definitive Edition. Um, so if you do enjoy the video, please hit the like button, and if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel, as this does help me out a lot. Alrighty, so let's begin. My name is Vito Scaletta. I was born in Sicily in 1925. That little guy's me. I'm standing there with my parents and my sister Francesca in front of our old house. I don't really remember too much about the old country, except that we were pretty hard up. And then one day my father decided it was time to move away. from Sicily, across the ocean, to start a new life in America. seen anything as fantastic as Empire Bay. It was beautiful. On the other hand, I'd never seen anything filthier, more disgusting than our new shithole of an apartment. The American Dream. It was more like a nightmare. My father started working at the port for the guy who arranged our immigration. It was backbreaking work, and what little money he made mostly went towards booze. Eventually, my parents sent me to school. I had to learn English. I sure as hell wasn't going to do that in a neighborhood full of Italians. That's where I met Joe. Come on, Vito, hurry it up. We ain't got all night. Over time, Joe and I got to be best friends. And since we were both poor and there wasn't much work around, <sighs> shit, we started a little business of our own. Freeze! Police! Stop! Vito, this way! Throw me to bed! Stop! Run and shoot! Shit. Okay, you bastard. Spread your legs. Fuck. Now put your hands on the fence. I'm sorry. Well, that one time it didn't work out so good. The year was 1943. America was at war. And the army was looking for guys who spoke the language to help with the invasion of Sicily. I was 18. And anything seemed better than jail. Who says you can't go home again? Operation Husky. I was assigned to the 504th Parachute Infantry. On the 11th of July, we were supposed to be dropped over the southern coast of Sicily, but we got hit by flak and had to bail out. Way behind enemy lines. Only three of us made it. If it wasn't for the local resistance, we wouldn't have had a chance. So when Mussolini soldiers came into the town and started rounding everybody up, we decided to return to fair. Se nessuno parla, quest'uomo morirà. Eh? No, 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 no.
Well, oh, I don't think going. he has to die. Hello. Let's see if we can uh, fix this. Go off this dude noi. first. Good catch up. Get him. Get him quickly. What a beautiful country to start the game off in. In Italy. Just a shame there's a war going on. Uh, one last dude left. Oh no, I think you got him. Sweet. Alright. Let's go. Ooh, not good, not good. Let's avoid the door for now. It uh, seems like it might fill us full of holes. Well, that's not good. Let's try to avoid more troops. Let's uh, get in. Alright, get the MG seems like a good idea. So, uh, yeah, when this game, or uh, well, the remaster got announced about a week ago, I've sort of been uh, waiting and uh, counting the minutes for it to come along, uh, but now it's finally here. Let's get a grenade on him. Well, someone's about to have a bad day. That's definitely one way to get him. Ooh. He is definitely going to be a crispy critter. Oh, well, better him than us. Yeah, so uh, when they announced it was going to come out, um, yeah, I was quite excited. So I uh, got up at 1.30 here in Australia in the morning to... Uh, Download it and uh, found out it was actually free if you already owned the uh, previous game, which was quite a nice surprise. I was not expecting that at all. Alright, what's through the door? Alright, let's get Ooh, okay, they got us. Let's them two down. Headshot. Alright, we go upstairs. No, nope, they got taken out of that grenade. What's up here? It's probably going to be a dude right around the corner. Is yep. he dead? Well, okay, he took a few more bullets than I was planning on giving him. Oh, whoa. Where the hell did you come from? Sneaky little bastard. The door, Skeletta. Kick it in. Why is he, like, stuck in uh, aiming down sights? Oh, right, good. Let's see if we can get this dude out here for anybody. Right, sweet. You, oh, oh. Well, we almost rescued them. Shit. Okay, there we go. Looks like we're going this way. Come on. Uh, how do we get back? Here we go. Let's see who we can get. Taking a bit of fire, not good. Serious. Yeah, I feel like this would definitely be a nice place uh, to visit. Oh. Okay, they almost got us. We're not doing well. Uh, so we are playing on medium. Um, definitely does not uh, give me an excuse for almost dying. But I will take it. Anyone in here? No. Cool, let's get this MG. Let's mess up some people's days. Wow, we're gonna get killed first. I do love the sound of this. MG3 could have a very, very nice sound. I've forgotten parts of this game. I've been a very long time since I have played it. Well, that's a little bit unfair. We don't have artillery. Uh, yeah, not good. Dicevo al mio amico di stare attento. Fregatene di fare attenzione, fai ciò che ti è stato detto! Davvero Don Calò? Cacetto, un congè quando si amareta come cucina. Ma chi è quello? Lo conoscete? Eh, lo conoscono tutti. 
Don Calò è un uomo d'onore. È uno stupido trucco degli americani, non ditemi che gli credete. No, è davvero Don Calò. Ogni tanto dovresti ascoltare i consigli di noi acci del posto. Ce ne andiamo. Sapete che potete fedarvi di me. Che ne dite, eh? Don Calò, the head of the Sicilian mob. An entire garrison of troops surrendered that day. Why? Because he told them to. A few years later, the Nazis put a bullet in me. I was in the hospital for a bit, then I got a month's leave so I could go home. At least for a little while. Vito! Over here! Joe! Hey! Welcome home, buddy. How'd you know? I got my sauces. Come on, let's take a ride. Nice car. Comes with the territory. I know you're itching to get home, but first, let's get a beer. Yeah, sure. There it is. Empire Bay. Tell the truth. Miss it? Hey, there's a bear shit in the woods. Alright, like so we are back in America. Fix, home yeah, sweet home. A foxhole. Um, a little bit colder than it was in Italy. A uh, bit more snow. Uh, uh, quite nice though. We've got some week. bombers flying over there. Worry, Looks though, like the uh, Brooklyn right Bridge. How long's it been since we had a drink together, Vito? Two years? Almost three. Tony Sicelli's party, right? It does um, look a Vito, lot better than the, um, we had was right after the original from what I can remember. Right before you shipped out. And the reflections are nice, the snow is nice. Ooh, what Talking happened here? Did he crash? Yeah, it looks like he crashed please. into the tree. So well, tell me, pal, he probably should definitely go back like to driver's ed. Anyway. I kept reading the papers to see what was going on. And you know how much I hate um, I'm yeah, a little bit disappointed in a way, ass, kind of, because right? I was hoping it might have some of the uh, deleted content from the original, no or shit. apparently the original was meant to have multiple endings. Really? Um, so I was kind of hoping I they might be in there, but um, apparently it's, them, from what I've read online, it's just purely a retexture and stuff, um, yeah. which is you nice, it was free, so you can never complain. But it does sort of bring the graphics, I'll make it a little bit more modern, sort of, so if you haven't played it before, it is definitely it's probably a good time to country. get into the game. Over here you can screw but, anything um, with a heart. Yeah, no, no that does look a lot better. So. A and it's mafia too. Here's you can to never go wrong with it. To having you back home. Salud. Ah, salud. Chin down. How come you're back? They let you out early for good behavior? Nah, I took a bullet a couple months back, spent some time in the hospital, and now I'm on leave. Wait, wait, wait. You mean you gotta go back? Yeah, <laughs> what'd you think? The war ain't over yet. You don't wanna go back, do you? Of course not, but what can I do? One minute. Wait right here. Hey, Giuseppe. It's Joe. Remember uh, last week, you know, the, guy, the guy's name is uh, Vito Scaletta. Thanks, Giuseppe. All right, I'll see you later. Okay, listen up. It appears that your injury is much more serious than it first appeared, and the doctors say you can't fight no more. What? Oh, whoa, whoa. did you just... Like I said, I know people. You get all the official paperwork tomorrow. When it comes to the right stamps and signatures, it's just a question of money. You're kidding me, right? <laughs> Isn't that a bit risky? It's me that can end up in a slammer, you know? And how am I going to pay for it? I got it covered. Think of it as a welcome home present. And don't worry, the documents will be clean. Trust me. Well, thanks. You're welcome. Como no you're like a brother to me. Now you can start thinking about what you're gonna do next. Sure. But first, I gotta go home. All right, you wanna ride? No, thanks. I wanna walk around a little, see what's changed since I've been gone. No problem. Say hello to your sister for me. 
Come see me tomorrow. We got a lot to talk about. I can't believe you just got me out of the service. Thanks again. No problem. I'll catch up with you tomorrow. Here we are. All right, thanks. Keep the change. All right. So, two dollars twenty-five for a cab ride. Either we didn't go far, or it is incredibly cheap. The good old forties. Let's sort of uh, walk and we'll uh, enjoy the area. I think we can interact with some people. How you doing, soldier? A lot better now that I'm home. You, you want to leave or home for good? That's uh, classified. So, uh, what's new around here? Tell the truth, not much. Everybody just wants the war to be over. And they're saying this is the coolest winter on record. Wish I had some good news. Yeah, you and me both. All right, I'll see you. Catch you later, buddy. Of course we come back to the coldest winter. Why wouldn't we? I do like it while it's uh, winter. Um, and... Our mission here is uh, definitely classified. If we uh, told him, we'd have to kill him. Oh, look, there's a uh, big ass rat. Uh, hello, Mrs. Uh... Vito? It is you. You look so handsome in that uniform. Your mother must be so proud. Uh... And what about poor Salvatore Montemaggiore? How is he doing? His poor mother was really expecting him home a week ago. Yeah, uh, Sal joined the Navy. I'm in the Army. It's different. Why don't you come inside and have some tea with me, Vito? You could tell me all about this. Thanks, but I'm kind of in a hurry. I just got back, and I can't wait to see my mother and Frankie. Such a pretty girl, that Francesca. It's a wonder she's not married yet. Well... Say hello to your mother for me, Vito. Well, I see why San Dimitri and blah 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 hasn't come back yet. Uh, if he has to endure her, I would probably stay over there as well. And I know this looks like giant beer. bird shadows. I feel it's like some giant eagle or something uh, flying over. Oh. Well, someone's not allowed out. So it sucks. Old lady's fast on us. We must beat her. Quick, Vito. Quick, quick. Oh, she's trying to cut us off. Oh, we're going to beat her around the corner. Kind of, sort of. Yes, we just beat an old lady around the corner. Uh, I have seen a few of the uh, famous Empire Bay uh, rats. What are you looking at? Beautiful bird. Oh, the bombers. I don't know if they were in the original. They, uh, I don't remember the bombers flying over. Well, it looks like someone had to shut shop. Fido? Is that you? Hey, Mr. Manara. You closing the shop? Yeah, you know how it is. Can't afford to stay in business. Wow, I'm, I'm sorry. Yeah, well, the war's not your fault, Vito. Who knows? Maybe when the war ends, I'll open up again. Well, uh, good luck then. Hey, thanks, kid. Well, he could always come join the Mafia with me. You know, probably pays better than whatever kind of shopkeeper he was. What was he? Menswear. Always need a good tailor. They're definitely not the nicest place to live. Oh. Okay. And then uh, just tried to kill us with a vase. Hopefully, uh, they keep it in their uh, building next time. It's a bit violent of them. Alright, we are at Mama's. Let's, uh, go see her. Before she lives on. Does it tell us or we just keep going? Hey, look, there's a putty cat. Hey, putty cat. Alright, well, screw you too then. Hi, Mama. I'm back. Vito. Vito, my boy. <laughs> my boy's home. I thought I'd never see you again. 
Francesca and me, we wait. Hey, yeah. sis, what's going and on? And we wait for you. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Sit down, oh. sit down. You must be hungry, Vito. Francesca made you a special dinner. Zuppa di pollo. It's good for you. Wow, looks good, Frankie. It's a shame your papa didn't live to see this. He would be so proud, Vito. Yeah, sure. Vito, you know better. I'm sorry, Mama, sorry. Benice, signore, pronunciare la propria volontà. Stiamo ricevendo provvedere la propria cucina che non hai. You should get some sleep. Your room is just like you left it. Well, fresh on the wall, looks like we've been sent to bed by Mama. Oh, we can talk to uh, Francesca. Uh, so how you two been? Franny, what have you been up to? I still live here with Mama. I got a nice office job. It pays the bills and I started paying off some of Papa's debts. Francesca, we don't want to talk about that now. We will continue this conversation later, Francesca. Away from Mama. Go to our room. Oh, open the door, really? Wow. So, uh, it looks like he left when he was like 15. Definitely got the uh, lovely rocking horse there and the uh, dog poster. He definitely can't go with, wrong with the uh, fashionable dog poster. Alrighty, let's go to bed. I'll see you two in the morning. Sleep well, mio bambino. Okay, so we will go ahead and end the video there. Uh, if you did enjoy it, please hit the like button. Um, and if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel as this does help me out a lot. And until next time, thanks for watching.